Do you want to be making thousands a month from OnlyFans? Do you want to make a profile that is going to go mainstream, where you have a source of income every day and you are making thousands upon thousands of dollars that you are achieving that luxurious lifestyle that you've always wanted? Well, watch this video. <laughs> Hey everyone, it's Stephen Brennand and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Okay, so before we get into this video, please remember to hit that subscribe button and press the bell button so you get alerted every time I upload a new video. And I really mean for you to subscribe to my channel because I am definitely going to be uploading a lot more of OnlyFans content and a lot more of these videos based on these types of topics so that I can help you be the best version of yourself and make some more coins so that you can better your lifestyle, better yourself, maybe get to the point where your wealth just starts generating more wealth. So. Please remember to subscribe to my YouTube channel, leave this video a big thumbs up and also leave it a comment. I am in the top 1% of creators on OnlyFans and I have only had it for just around a month. I'm really good at social media, I know how things work, I know how to build myself a platform and operate on social media. I'm very surprised that I'm in the top 1% this soon but I'm not surprised that I grew on it as fast as I did just because I've had a lot of practice with social media. But if you are not really familiar with OnlyFans or how to grow a platform on there, then definitely just hear what I have to say because everything I've learned, all my knowledge based around every type of social media like TikTok, Instagram, YouTube, I can really help you grow your brand. So I'm guessing you clicked on this video because you want to make thousands of dollars a month from OnlyFans. Well, guys, guess what? That is possible. It's so possible. You can make 100K a month if you want. My first tip for you would be to set yourself a target. Do you want to make 1K a month? Do you want to make 10K a month? Do you want to make 50K a month? Do you want to make 100K a month? Whatever it is, put it on a piece of paper and stick it up so that you always see it every day and you know what you're working towards because you'll find that when you define your goal, then your mission becomes a lot clearer and you can start actually achieving success a lot more quicker because you know what you're working towards whereas if you're kind of trial and error in OnlyFans that's fine but you're stunting your growth when we know what we're going towards then nothing's going to get in our way so please whatever it is set yourself a goal let's just talk about the basics on OnlyFans you have the three main sources of income one is PPV which is pay per view so this means that when someone is on your OnlyFans, you can send out content on messages. So let's say I sent out a picture going, me totally topless on the beach with my abs all wet. And I just, I sent that out for $5. Well, I send that picture out, but no one can actually see the picture. It's locked. However, you can see the caption and you can choose to purchase it or not. So you set a price on the content. It's up to you what you set it at. But let's say that you have thousands of subscribers. The lower you set it, the better, just because more people are going to buy it anyway. So you might sell it for $3, but if a thousand people buy it, that's $3,000. But obviously, please remember to value yourself because you're not worth nothing, okay? So, pay-per-view is one source of income. Another source of income is subscriptions. In regards to subscriptions, people that I know charge a really high amount on OnlyFans just for you to join their profile, for them to only post like once or twice on the main page. However, my OnlyFans is $4.49 to join. So guys, onlyfans.com forward slash Stephen Brennan. Please go join my OnlyFans if you haven't already. It's literally $4.49 right now. Get it while you can. Mine is $4.49 and I believe that that is actually such a crucial component to growing on OnlyFans and why I'm already in the top 1%. So many people have signed up to my OnlyFans because it's such a cheap subscription. Now, I'm not saying to make your subscription really low. All I'm saying is that the higher it is, and you being a new user on OnlyFans as well, it just doesn't really help unless you've already got an existing platform. But let's say that, let's say that you're just building, you're building a platform currently, like my, my YouTube, I'm building my YouTube. Well, for me to have a low subscription price on my OnlyFans, helps get as many people as I can over to there because it's fine when you're already famous but when you are just building yourself a platform you actually need to be very smart with OnlyFans because if you are making OnlyFans and you don't really have a lot of followers you don't have a very big social presence then 
why is someone going to subscribe to your profile when they could subscribe to an already existing celebrity? So what I found is that setting low price subscriptions really helps build your profile. And I think people see my subscription price and think, oh, it's so low, you could be making so much more money. But the thing is, I do, because those people that subscribe to my profile tip and buy content from me anyway. It just means that there's more people on my OnlyFans for me to sell content to. Speaking of content, definitely offer the opportunity to make your subscribers personalise and customise content, which basically means that if they request a video or picture from you, make that possible for them to do so. Obviously at an added price. Now if you are selling customised content every day, that is really going to help increase the amount of dollars that you're making. You can make thousands in a day just by doing that. Now also, please remember to cherish your relationships on OnlyFans because those people are choosing to support you. What I do is I talk to as many people as I can. Not everyone responds, but I still message everyone and I have conversations with people. I try to get to know people. I just think it's really good to provide something back. Now obviously, if you subscribe to my OnlyFans, you're getting all my content, but I think it's nice when there's a human touch. So. What I would say to you to do is to be active on there every day. Be talking to your subscribers, just get to know them well. Offer a good service, you know. If you offer them a good service, then they will put their rebuild on. So yes, rebuild. Rebuild is basically when someone joins your OnlyFans, they can either choose to pay for one month or they can pay for one month and turn on their rebuild so that they get charged every month for it. So not a lot of people will put on their rebuild straight away because they don't know what they're getting into. But if you provide the best service that you can, then a lot of people will turn on their rebuild. If someone tips you, send them content. If it's a really low tip, you could even send them a voice note. Just make sure that the people who tip you are getting something because that's really sweet. So yes, the third source of income on OnlyFans is tips. People can choose to tip you. You have PPV, subscriptions and tips. Now I think for each individual creator that they rank differently. Offer deals. So if someone is a regular tipper or if someone is always purchasing your content, then maybe offer them a free month subscription, talk to them a lot more, just be present and be making sure that you are really providing a good service, okay? Now, getting people onto the platform can be hard. So I know a lot of people use Twitter. I personally use TikTok, which has really helped me so much. I already have over 50,000 followers on TikTok. I just need to keep posting videos on TikTok now to make sure the word gets out that I have OnlyFans. So if you have a social media with a big following already, besides Snapchat, because you can't do Snapchat, otherwise you get banned. But if you already have that, then make sure you are promoting yourself every day. Yes, every day. It might get tiring, but you need to stay relevant, stay promoting yourself, otherwise someone else is going to be promoting themselves and you want people on your profile, okay? So please, please, please promote yourself and be aware that you're going to have to do that if you want to be making thousands a day. I don't know if you're listening to that and you're thinking it's hard, but honestly, it's not too hard if you just work at it, if you're just making sure that you're posting something every day to promote yourself, then you can be fulfilling that objective, that task. An example would be, on TikTok I posted a video, sometimes my videos get a thousand views and then I'll get a couple signups but I posted a video the other day and it got over 40,000 views and you can imagine I got quite a few signups because in my captions on my TikToks I always put subscribe to my OnlyFans so obviously that was exposed to 40,000 plus people and then I got a couple signups which is really good. Just make sure that you are promoting yourself on a platform. However, it can't really be OnlyFans itself because people expect that they can grow organically on there. You can't. It's not like Instagram where someone's gonna come across your profile. It just doesn't work like that. And for some reason, not a lot of people listen to that and they think that they're just gonna make a profile, put in a caption, and then people are gonna subscribe. It does not work like that. Let me repeat, it does not work like that. You have to promote yourself on other social medias to get traffic to your OnlyFans. Be responsive to all your fans, all your subscribers. Make sure you are just keeping in contact with them and answering their questions. So if you do want some more secret tips that have really helped me get to the 1% of top creators, 
then use my referral code. I'll link it in the description. I will also comment it down below on my video. If you use my subscription, then drop me a message on Instagram or on here and then we can talk and I can really help you grow on OnlyFans if you're very serious about it because I, I know what to do and I can help you so much. If you've got potential, let's do this. So definitely use my referral code. Other than that, remember to subscribe to my OnlyFans. It's only $4.49. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. I'll oh, wait. Did you subscribe? Cool, thanks. Leave this video a big thumbs up and a comment. Okay, everyone, thank you so much for watching my video and I will see you in the next one. Bye.